<laughs> Remember, I've been indicted more than Al Capone. The great man. I never heard the word indicted. I didn't know. Now all of a sudden, if I fly over a Democrat state, they call it a blue state, I get subpoenaed before a grand jury. It's horrible. Honestly, it's horrible what they're doing. They're ruining this country. But this is a case of blatant manipulation of the law, the facts, like Russia, 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 and all of the other hoaxes that we've had to endure. The phony indictment has been torn apart and demolished by legal experts from across the political spectrum. Every single legal expert, without exception, that I can find, has said, as an example, Alan Dershowitz. Alan Dershowitz said, I've been doing this for 60 years, teaching criminal cases, defending criminal cases, writing about criminal cases, and this is by far the weakest criminal case I've ever seen in my 60 years. There is absolutely nothing here. There is no misdemeanor. There is no felony. There is no federal crime. Every American is in danger if we don't have an objective standard of justice that's equally applicable to all. That's Alan Dershowitz. He's a Democrat. He's no fan of mine. He's a Democrat. And the Harvard professor, smart guy, but he's a Democrat. He writes that. Here's another one. Highly respected former federal prosecutor, Andrew McCarthy, stated, it would take us an hour just to flush out all of the problems with this case. The premise of this prosecution is falsification. What Bragg, that's Alvin Bragg, he's a Soros appointed prosecutor. By the way, crime in New York is at record highs. The violent crime, murders, killings, all of the stuff, muggings, and he leaves them alone. They've got so when I go into court over nothing, it's not a crime. When I go into court, they've got like nine prosecutors, and in the meantime, people that murder, nobody does anything. What Bragg, Alvin Bragg, is trying to do is enforce federal campaign finance law which he doesn't have any authority whatsoever to do. He's not allowed to finance. And by the way, the federal government looked at it, turned it down. It's a garbage case that he himself rejected a year earlier. When Bragg came into office, he's the district attorney. He said, I'm not doing this case. This case is bullshit. And then what happened? <laughs> and you know, here's the thing. They could have done this case seven years ago. You know the way they're trying to rush it? This case would have been fine. Seven years ago, do whatever you want. They do it right smack in the middle of our election campaign. And I talk about our campaign. We want to do it now. And the same thing with Deranged Jack Smith, all of these people. These are Biden people. He can't win an election. He can't put two sentences together. He can't find the stairs on a platform to walk off after he makes about a two-minute speech. Here they are. I got one, two. I got one in the back. I got them all over the place. He can't find them. <laughs>